What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. That's all of a sudden at age, what, 60? He's just going to break bad? Driver's lines was cut at the TA. It was probably done in the fuel island because that's where a majority of the trucker shenanigans is at. Maybe he went in there and took a little bit too long and somebody messed with his equipment, as always. <laughs> No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. So I'm at the TA in Georgia. Truck broke down in front of me. Uh, I can't get out. I asked him if he was broke down. He said no. Somebody cut his lines. What lines they cut? Oh, wow. That ain't gonna help it. If his lines was cut, though, how was he able to move? Was it, well, maybe a part of it might have been a, just a little cut, just a little gaze, but how he was able to move to where he was at from the fuel island, if that's where he was coming from. But listen, truck drivers, listen, I'm, I'm telling you, you know, from the bottom of my heart, please, please stop messing with driver's equipment. It is dangerous. It is messed up. And people can get hurt. They got lines in the, in the TA here. Okay. Yeah, driver's lines got cut. Ain't that a bitch man people out here fucking with other truck drivers and equipment well i'm gonna get off here i'm gonna see if i can help him love you b you have a good day shout out to that driver right there that took the time to get out to offer some type of assistance drivers let me know in the comments below what do you think happened what do you think led up to the situation of the driver being his lines cut now there was another tiktoker that stitched the video and said that there was a different way that he could have repaired that but i i honest don't i honestly don't think electrical tape is going to do it <laughs> uh he probably i i guess after all is said and done i'm going to assume that he went into the ta got him a new set of you know lines airlines and you know the pigtail and everything and hopefully he'll be all right. Man, what, what do we need to do, drivers? What do we need to do to protect ourselves from idiots that goes out there just to mess with our equipment? Do we need to put additional cameras out there? Do we need to, what, what do we need to do, man? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Big G's got it locked, boy. Won't you let me out?